Hello and welcome to the channel. I'm Volcano AC and in this episode I will unbox my new Mac Studio computer. In a previous episode I shared the purchase process of this Mac. I'm very excited because it will be my very first Apple computer. I do have though a couple of iPads and iPhones which I truly love so if this Mac Studio is as smooth as these other iOS devices, then I'll definitely love it too. I can't wait to connect my Apollo X6 audio interface to my new Mac Studio. Link in the description below why I can't use my current gaming PC with my Apollo audio interface. Note that this is not a sponsored video. I purchased this Mac with my own money. I bought it at Costco because it was on sale and it was cheaper than at the Apple store or even Best Buy. It cost me a total of $1,949 with 48 cents, including tax. If you want to check out how I selected this computer, check out the video in the description below. I had it shipped to Costco warehouse near me and I just received an email indicating that it is ready to be picked up. It took about four days between purchase and delivery. To make the video more interesting, let's go together to pick it up. Let's go. All right, and the day has come. I'm gonna pick up my Apple Mac Studio. Let's go. And this is a package. I'm getting it right now. I don't see any Apple logos. However, I'm extremely excited, as you can see. All right, and I have my Apple Mac Studio here, and I'm ready to go home and unbox it. Let's go. All right, so we are back in my home studio and here it is, the Mac Studio ready to be unboxed. And to be honest, it really doesn't say that this is an Apple computer. It only has on the side the part number and serial number and it says computer made in Vietnam. Check it out. All right, this package has a good weight to it. so. I'm hoping that this computer really is gonna last me for many years to come. And like I mentioned at the beginning, the most important for me is gonna be to manage my Apollo X6 audio interface. All right, let's start the unboxing. All right, let's open up. Nice. Nice. Okay. Oh, there we go. There we go. Look at that! It's looking good so far. Woo. All right. It's all in the box. Beautiful Mac Studio, that is awesome. There we go. Look at that. Already in the picture, it looks great. Apple logo on the side. The different connections, just like I showed in the previous episode. I think in 
this other side right here I have serial number and stuff so what you can see right there 32 gigabytes of unified memory 512 gigabytes SSD storage with the Apple M2 Max chip that is incredible all right Time for something amazing, which is going to be opening it up right there. Woo. Nice. There we go. Beautiful pack. And remember, this is when you buy the computer not those bunch of sponsored videos that you watch all the time made in Vietnam but decided in California and here we are here it is look at this very very well protected the cord right here Let me move this. Cord wrapped really nicely. So like we saw in the instructions uh, when we purchase, there's two parts only. One is the computer and the other one is this the cable there's nothing else here folks okay so cable is right there ready to be plugged in and here it is ladies and gentlemen the Apple Mac Studio. Whew. Beautiful. Now let me pick it up with both hands and you can see at the top it has the Apple logo and then in the front you can see the two USB-C ports and one SDXC card slot. And of course the indicator if it's on and off. And then on the back you can see on the left the four Thunderbolt ports and then one 10 gigabytes ethernet port. Then you can see the connection for the power, then two USB-A ports, one HDMI port, and the one 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And of course, next to it, the on and off button. On the underside, so meaning at the bottom, you can see where it vents. So that's great to know. All right, and here it is. This is my brand new, Apple Mac Studio, and I'm extremely excited, especially in terms of connectivity, because I'll be able to use my Apollo X6 audio interface all the time, and not only when my laptop with Thunderbolt connection is available. In addition to the connectivity, I'm extremely excited because this Mac Studio is a true powerhouse, and I'll be able to have all the instances of Massive X plugin open without issues. And beyond that, I will also be able to have all the plugins from Arturia that I like so much, hopefully without any single issue. All right, and that is all for this episode. If you like this video, don't forget to smash the like button. And for more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe Thank you for stopping by and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.